Hey everyone, I'm Arnita Champion and I'm bringing you a 30 minute beginner's kettlebell workout. It's gonna be simple. The only thing you're gonna need is of course, a kettlebell. I'm gonna be using a 15 pound kettlebell. But if you feel that you're not a beginner and you wanna up the ante a little bit, just add more weight or add more weight to your kettlebell or add more reps. I'm gonna be doing four exercises. Why four, Arnita? Mm, let me tell you. It's a champion now, a champion, forever. So remember that. I'm going to warm you up. I'm going to do the workout and then I'm going to cool you down. Okay. So go at your own pace. Do not continue to do any exercises or any moves if you feel any sharp pain. Okay. And check with your physician before you carry out any type of exercise program. All right. Let's get started. I'm gonna warm you up. You're just gonna walk, or I would say high knee lift right in place. Just right here. One, two, three. Four, we're gonna do 25. Five, six, Mookie's tight. I'll call this my Mookie. Eight, nine, 10, 11, you can march. 12, and 13, and 14, and 15. Add your sauce. 16, and 17, and 18, and 19. Smile, 20, 21. 22, 23, 24, and 25. You should get your heart rate up just a little bit, not to the point where you're feeling winded. You should still be able to talk during your warm up, okay? Next, we're gonna go to the side. Open up those hip flexors. Same way, it's a side high knee lift, and it goes like this. One, two, three, and four, and five. Core tight six, Mookie tight seven, and eight, and nine, no sharp movements. 10, 11, go smooth. 12, and 13, and 14, I see you. 15, and 16, and 17, and 18, and 19, have fun, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. We're gonna do that twice, okay? But the other warm-up exercise we're gonna do, you already know, it's called a jack. If you don't know what a jack is, I'm gonna show you. We're gonna do 25 jumping jacks, really easy. It's gonna look like this. One, two, three, four, five, movies tight, six, seven. If this is too much on your knees, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I'm still talking, one, 22, 23, 24, 25, ah! Okay. That was your first round. We're gonna do another round just to get you a little wind, okay? High knee lift to the side, jack, and then we're gonna jack you up on the workout. Ready, high knee lift, let's go. And this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, also eight, nine, you're gonna need water, 10, 11, 12, and a towel, 13, 14, if you break a sweat, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Remember, have fun with this, okay? Your workout should never be to the point where it's torture, okay? Or you don't like it. Side, let's go. One, two, three, four, bring it up. Five, six, perfect. Seven, eight, nine, ten, have fun. Eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, you should feel it, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Come on, five, four, three, two, and one. Feel that? I, I know you do. All right, jacks. We're gonna do 25 jacks, and remember, modified, you're just gonna step out, okay? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Come on, count, count. you 16 7 8 9 20 core tight 1 2 3 4 5 ah. shake it out what I want to do now calm your heart rate down just a little bit because it's probably beating just a little bit but I'm still warming you up okay feet shoulder width apart or more than shoulder width apart you're gonna go down touch your toes come up Arms out, down, touch your toes. Watch me. Up, down, touch your toes. Up, down, touch your toes. 
up, down, touch your toes, up, down, touch your toes. Shake it out, arm circles, because we're gonna be using our arm with the kettlebell, of course. Circle, circle, get those rotator cuffs, get those arms ready, okay? Good, here, come on, good. Let's take it back, and back. Just make your funky music or your favorite music goes on. You know, I like funky music, okay? We're just gonna push our hands forward and boom, pop, boom, boom, pop, boom, boom, pop. Push it back, push it back, boom, pop. Yeah, dun, dun, sh and shake it out. All right, got you warm a little bit here, got you warm a little bit here, got you warm a little bit here. Let's go through the exercises. Your first, exercise, your first exercise, of course, is going to be what I call a kettlebell swing. Some people get this wrong, but I'm gonna make it right, okay? Again, using a 15 pounder, I'm gonna show you sideways and front, okay? The front way, I'll start with the side. Sideways, my feet are more than shoulder width apart, and I'm gonna go, I'm gonna let this kettlebell take me back, okay? I'm gonna let it take me back and go down. I'm not gonna do a squat. Most people do this. I'm not gonna do that. There's nothing wrong with that. You just have to make sure your technique is right. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna go down, squeeze your glutes. Down, squeeze your glutes. And you don't have to bring this kettlebell up high, okay? That side view, squeeze my glutes. I'm squeezing my glutes like crazy. Okay, I'm gonna do it front for you. That's how many, that's what I'm gonna do for you. And we're gonna do each exercise, which is four. We're doing it three times 15. That's beginners. If you need more, amp up the reps or amp up the weight. Okay, let's go with the swings. I'm gonna count and I'm gonna ask you to count as well. Got it? Let's go. Let's go. One. Two, three, squeeze. Four, squeeze. Five, good. Six, I see you. Seven, eight, I'm not locking my knees. Nine, squeezing my glutes. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, I feel it. 15. <sighs> when you finish the kettlebell, don't try to stop it. A lot of times people try to stop it, close their legs, bam. Knees are jacked up for life, okay? You're gonna get like a 10 second rest, breathing. You can actually get a little sip of your spark. If you don't know what spark is, get some. I put it down in the comment box, okay? Let's go, second set, let's go. Count, come on, squeeze, come on. This is our first exercise. Eight, nine, ten. Let it take you back. Eleven, twelve. Try to focus on something. Fourteen and fifteen. See how I just let that kettlebell swing? Not gonna jack up my knees. So remember, try to focus on something so that when you're going down, coming back up, you do not get lightheaded. Because I promise you, you may faint. Okay, you may faint. It's okay. All right, 10 seconds rest. Probably already got five seconds already, but I'm a good coach. Let's do this. Feet more than shoulder width apart. Last set, let's go. Squeeze. front lunges. I'm going to go to the front, okay? I'm going to go to the side so that you can see it, and I'm going to go to the front as we're working it out. 
So the side lunges look like this. I'm actually gonna have my foot right underneath me, so my knee is not gonna go over, okay? I'm gonna have my back knee, my back leg, like in a, uh, like a table set. You know the table right there? No, no, no. Anyway, for the beginners, you're gonna hold it right here. When you come up, squeeze. When you go down, roll. Make sure, okay? Beginners, make sure it's lightweight because you don't want to have to tilt her, tilt her over. For those individuals that are wanting a more, you know, more challenge, even with this weight, what you're gonna do, gonna still hover, but you're gonna put this forward a little bit. Back, back, back. Got it? Okay? If you need it modified. You're not gonna squat down. Gonna, it's called a bent over row kinda. Right here, putting your knee, putting your leg on your knee, bending over, core's tight, and you're rowing. One, two, three. You shouldn't be all over the place. <sighs> okay, keep it tight, right here. One, two, got it? No, I'm not gonna do more, okay? Because that way I'll be 20 and you guys would have only done 15. All right? We're going to do each side. 15, 15. Ready? For starters, I'll start right here. And let's go. One. Not one. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, you should feel it. Six, I feel it. Seven, eight, I feel it, I really do. Nine, 10, keep it tight, keep everything tight. 11, I don't want any chicken wings out here. 12, no. 13, push it back like you're elbowing something. 14, and 15. Switch it to the other side, okay? Ready? You ready? If you want water or your drink, go ahead and get it. Ready? Down and one, two, core tight, three, four. I hear some little dogs, five. I think they want to work out too. Six, seven, no jerky. When I say that, no momentum. Nine, 10, breathing. 11, 12, 13, I see you, even though I'm looking this way. 14 <laughs> and 15. How's that? You like it? <laughs> I know, right? That's what my last name champion. All right, let's go. You don't get a lot of rest but you do get rest to the point where your technique is not compromised, okay? Want some water? Okay. Put your down, mosey over. I've got spark. If you don't have this, what's your problem? You need it. Gets me every time. Let me show it to you. Yeah. No, you can't have mine. Get your own, okay? It'll be in the it'll be in the context area, okay? Second set. Let's go. And one, two, three, four. Count for me. Good. Count for me. Six. Perfect. Good. Push yourself, but only push yourself to the point where you're comfortable, okay? Just because I'm doing this and it may look easy. 14, I think, is that 14? 15. Did you count 14? Don't cheat me, okay? I see you, all right? Let's go. 
other leg. Ready? And let's go. One. Two, count for me. Three. What I was saying was gauge yourself, okay? Be who you are and no one else. You're your own champion, okay? What number is that? My quads are burning. Is that it? Okay, is that it, you guys? Are you counting? Are you counting? Okay, how many we got? Four? Oh, five more. You guys aren't even counting. I hit it in my head. Let's go. Down. Five. Let's go. Four. Let's go. Three. Come on. Two. And one. Okay. So this is a pack here, okay? This is partnership, okay? When I say count, let's count. All right, let's go to the side. Last set. And go. One, two, three. Let's go. Four, core tight. Five, six, seven, eight. For you modified, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I'm gonna go right over to the next side, making it burn. Ready? Let's go. One, two, three, let's go. Four, God. My legs are burning. Five. Are yours burning? Six. Have you stopped yet? Seven. If you stopped and took a break, give me a high five when you come back. Nine. Is that nine? Ten. Let's go. Whoop. Eleven. You see that safe? Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Oh. I don't know what y'all, but we're gonna go to the next one. The next one is the squat with the with the press up. Okay, so we're going to squat with the kettlebell and press up. Four sets or three sets of fifteen. Ready? Looks like this. You're gonna squat with your kettlebell with your hand on top of the kettlebell. When you're raising it up, go ahead and slide it and raise it up. Got it? Let's go. I'll show you the modified version. The modified version is actually a deadlift and bring it right up. Okay, side view, a deadlift, bring it up. Side view of the regular, squat up. Squat up. Okay, that was two for me, okay? I don't care what you say, that was two. If you did two, Good, if you didn't, catch up with me. Let's go. One. That's three. <laughs> Four. Five. Six. Seven. Let's go. Eight. Stay with me. Nine. Stay with me. 10. 11. 12, you got it, 13, let's go, 14, 15, 10 seconds rest, I know you got it, time to take a drink, if not, okay, you got me, I mean, I am 59, right? Yeah, right? <laughs> I had to put that in there. Here I go. All right. Let's go. One, two, modified. Three, modified side. Four, five, regular. Six, Seven, 
eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. You may think that um, a half hour workout isn't a lot, but let me tell you, when you have the correct form and you have ample enough rest or limited rest, you'll feel it. Last set, ready? Ready? Let's go. And it's one. Come on. Two. You got it. Three. Modify. Four. If the weight is too heavy, five. Drop it. Six on your toes. Seven. Got it? Eight. Okay? Take it back up. Nine. Ten. Regular. Eleven. 12, 13, 14, come on, come on, work with me, 15, see, I get one to two because I want to feel what you're feeling, so I'm not excluded from anything, your last exercise, a drink, got you, your last exercise, is going to be what I call figure eight. You're only doing two of these, okay? You're doing a squat and you're doing the figure eight between your legs, okay? Making sure you don't hit your shins or your ankles because it's gonna hurt. I'm gonna say 30 seconds. You don't have to worry about the 30 seconds. I'll do it, okay? Let's go. This is the last exercise. And I'm gonna cool you now. Yes. You're gonna squat right here. For those that can't be right here, stand. Bend over, deadlift, okay? Let's go. 30 seconds on the clock. My timer starts now. Let's go. This way. Easy, nice and easy. Stand down. Nice and easy. Don't worry about it. Remember, if you're up, bend down right there. Good. Let's go. Let's go. Stay down. Time is almost running down. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh. I told you we were going to do two, right? The two actually is now we're gonna reverse it. We went in, and now we're gonna go backwards. Reverse, okay? Ready? Let's go. If you're not ready, take a break or pause. Whatever you're on, your camera, your TV, or whatever, pause me, and I'll be right here when you come back. Let's go. 30 seconds, and start, and now, let's go. One. I'm going the opposite way. Two. Let's go. I'm beginning to sweat. Three. I've been sweating. What the heck? Let's go. Remember right here. Reach through it. Get it? If your kettlebell drops, you got to start over. Don't let that puppy drop. Let's go. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. You did it. You did it. I'm gonna cool you down. I wanna thank you for working out with me, okay? We're gonna cool down with a little bit of stretching, a little bit of motivational topics that I want you to stress throughout the week so that you know who you are and who you are. Catch your breath. We're gonna move this over here. Gonna wipe my glistening. I don't sweat. I glisten. Okay. Put that right there. You did great. Ready? 
feet shoulder width more so apart. Relax your shoulders. Take a deep breath. And congratulate yourself on what you've just done. We're gonna raise our arms up. Forget everything that you brought here. Forget the fear of working out. Forget the other workouts that you did not do. You completed this workout. That's all that matters. Reach out. Again, I'm proud of you. You are a champion now, and you are a champion forever. I'm gonna step back, keep my feet together. I'm gonna turn sideways so you can actually see it, because we did a lot of legs. Turn sideways. Roll your back down or roll your upper torso down, vertebrae by vertebrae. Just let it go ahead and hunch like a hunchback. If you can, separate your legs just a little bit. Let your, let your top or let your torso just bring you down. Touch if you can. If you can't, just grab your ankles, okay? Touch. Touch and relax. There should be nothing tense about it, like, you should be good. Touch. I'm not gonna come up fast because the blood is rushing to your head now. You come up fast, you're gonna have to call Mayday. Roll up, slowly, slowly, slowly. Let your head be the last thing that comes up. Roll your shoulders back. Yeah, got me glistening in here. What the world? Pull them back. Pull them back. Go forward. I thank you for working out with me. Come back and see me on other exercise videos. If I'm on the rebound, I'll catch you on the rebound. Or if I'm doing any other exercise, kettlebell, weights, pro source fit equipment, I want you to come back being a champion now and a champion forever. Put in the comment what you thought about this beginner's kettlebell workout. If you wanted to add more, tell me you added more. I'm Arnika Champion. Follow me on all of my social media platforms. Find me being a champion now and a champion forever. I'm out.